the Galactic Free Press update. Bringing humanity home, energy and event update. The energies will continue intensifying. Greetings, love beings. We have shared and many others as well. The energies will continue to intensify more each moment. This will make way for a smooth transition from the old to the new paradigm. The light will continue to grow exponentially and there is nowhere to go for those who would like this planet to remain the same. This planet is forever changed because of the efforts of love beings awake across the planet and there is only up from here. The Arcturian group through Marilyn Raffaele. Much is coming to fruition at this time and we see the light of your dear planet Earth becoming intense and awakened. Much is soon to manifest as a result of your hard work, dear ones. So do not be surprised as you witness many traditions beginning to crumble. It is a time of transition and shifting to new ways of seeing, being, and living. You will be pleasantly surprised when the planet finally realizes that there is no need for war, separation, cruelty, and extreme power held by a few. These concepts are remnants of an energy that is now completing for those of you choosing to move forward. This new planet is, a, is represented <clears throat> through new ways of living and yet it is not new at all. For you are simply now awakening to the realization that you are and always have been one. All living things are connected by virtue of their being in and of the one omnipresent, one omnipotent, and one omniscient consciousness. As the manifestation of source, you are also one with every divine idea within divine consciousness. Think upon that, dear ones. You are actually one with divine ideas of abundance, joy, peace, divine intelligence, completeness, wholeness, and so much more. These divine ideas are held in place by law. End of quote. Quoted from Stella Capozzi. If wishes are intentions and intentions are wishes, then I wish that, finally, the people of planet Earth could live in a state of peace and abundance. I wish that Mother God could at last spread her wings and that her children could breathe fresh, clean air. The wars and the suffering would come to an end right now, and the land and the water would be pure, unpolluted, and thriving with life. The veil of secrecy is so ridiculously obsolete, and I fervently pray that it be ripped away to expose the magnificent paradise of the 5D Earth, which lay just on the other side. Yes, it is real honestly, and it's there, ready and waiting. Now, all that's left for us to do is to choose the correct road to get there, check our baggage at the door, and move in. The horrors we leave behind in 3D will be only a distant and incomprehensible memory, hard lessons never to be repeated. End of quote. All of humanity was ignited to awaken in 2007 when Mother Earth equal heart and Father Sky equal sun connected in the physical realm for the first time in 19 billion years. Then, on December 21st, 2007, the planet entered the photon belt. For the last five years, humanity has been flying through space through the photon belt. On December 21st, 2012, Mother Earth Equal Heart will reach her destination to the center of this universe, which represents the heart equal oneness. Those choosing to ascend with Mother Earth Equal Heart are about to take a huge leap forward in consciousness. More and more are now awakening, and this is getting really exciting. The more who awaken, the brighter and lighter the planet becomes, and a smoother transition will manifest. Quoted from Emmanuel Dollar. We have the opportunity right this minute to hold a sacred space of love and compassion for the planet as a whole to step into. 
even if many are still caught up in the seeming upheaval and fear mindset. Each one of us is powerful and fully capable of being able to hold this sacred space of love and compassion for the whole planet. I've always felt that even if there was only one person on the planet holding a consistent space of love and compassion for the masses, eventually that one person will create a domino effect, allowing the whole planet to match the same vibration of love and compassion that that person was able to tap into. However, thank goodness we have an abundance of radiant beings around the planet committed to holding a continuous space of love which is allowing the collective transition to move more quickly. Up until the end of August, the energies have been quietly, relatively quiet. This brief pause allotted us some time to integrate with the intense energies that entered the collective consciousness back in July and the first few days of August. Now, a general sense of anticipation is slowly building back up as we enter the final quarter to what has already been a paradigm-shifting year. By now, it's no longer a secret that great personal and global changes are taking place. Some of these changes can feel blissful, while others may feel the complete opposite. The key to moving through it all is to remain grounded in love. End of quote. These incoming energies will serve all of you in many ways. They are cleansing humanity of the program mind. They are bringing forward all the lies, and the, and the more this unfolds, the more the truth steps forward onto the main stage of planet Earth Equal Heart. They are assisting in the cleanup of the planet, and they are activating all divine decrees for manifestation and all divine contracts of service to love. And they are bringing in higher energies for grander experiences of joy. Love loves surprises, and love loves to give surprises. Lucky humanity, they are all made in love. Decreed by heaven, we are now spiraling quickly together into the present moment of now. This is the divine plan manifesting now on planet Earth equal heart. Join us live for the Internet Love Party beginning at 10.30 a.m. Pacific, Wednesday, September 5th. Thank you for spreading these messages to others and keeping your hearts open and staying tuned in. Just be present and follow the synchronistic events. And transmission and all love is unconditionally. We are so in love with humanity. Love the Galactic Free Press staff, humanity's Earth allies, the company of heaven, and the first contact ground crew team. The Galactic Free Press update. Bringing humanity home and...